Hey everyone, Dan here. How we doing today? Uh, have a 2004 Honda Civic LX with a bit of a simple issue. The um, headlight buzzer wasn't working and um, effectively, since, you know, the buzzer's not working, you would get out of your car, you know, go do whatever you're doing and uh, come back and your car battery would be dead because your headlights were on the whole time and you would forget. So, um, yeah, I did a little research on the issue. Couldn't really find anything super solid, why it wasn't working. Um, uh, so I took a look at my door switches here and noticed that this switch that sits in this tiny little, you know, nipple kind of bracket was actually completely popped out and it was down in this hole here. It was actually, I had to fish it out. Um, the uh, bracket here acts as a ground for the circuit that this runs on. There's only one wire that runs into it. And as you can see, if I can get the camera to unblur, you see there's only one wire running into it. The bracket adds X as a ground for it. So unless the um, the switch is plugged into the bracket and the bracket is, uh, was it bolted to the car where it is, um, circuit doesn't work. And effectively your, your headlight switch won't, uh, camera keeps blurring, there we go. Uh, effectively your headlight buzzer won't work and your dome light won't turn on when you uh, open your car doors. And I found the same problem to be for the other side as well. I guess it's just a manufacturing issue or whatever. After so many years, the car is like, you know, about what, 16 years old at this point, 17 or 15 rather. Um, the, uh, you know, I guess bracket gives way a little bit uh, or a little metal prongs here and uh, rather, and um, it'll pop out. So I already have it plugged into the bracket here. Um, it just plugs straight in pretty easy. Uh, this little piece here, the little button was down in here. Like I mentioned, I had to get a screwdriver here, flathead. And, uh, basically I just went in, I picked the wire up a little bit here so I can at least get it in view inside that hole there. Uh, and then I just took a pair of pliers here and just carefully, as you can see where I kind of crumpled the, uh, the wire harness protection, I carefully pulled it out um you know or at least pulled it out uh so i could see the switch and then i would i essentially just kind of twisted the switch a little bit until it eventually came out it was kind of awkward getting the switch out um it looks like it won't come out it definitely will you just kind of get it at the right angle i wish i still left it in there but uh yeah yeah i mean you'll get the idea it's just once you get this up once you get into here like you, you just got to get it at the right angle it will come out i promise um but yeah once it's out just reattach it to the little bracket right here. Um, because this bracket acts as a ground, you can't test it until it's actually bolted back together. So just reattach it um, right now. I can actually show you headlight on, no buzzer. Uh, let's see, take this with it back on. One little eight millimeter bolt holds this bracket in, just hidden behind a little, you know, cover. So you just take your bolt, thread it in real quick. Thread, 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 get your ratchet. Again, as I mentioned, eight millimeter. Just gonna take this, tighten it down real quick. And then once I have this effectively tightened down all the way, the headlight buzzer will work. Just one more quick little turn, just get it not too tight. I don't have a torque spec for you, <laughs> but you'll feel it just snug. That's all you need. And you can see now it's in there. Um, you'll definitely be able to tell the buttons on in here because obviously you won't have anything to press. So maybe if you have the same issue, you'll be able to see that like I did. Uh, there you go. Now I turn the headlight on and there you go. Now it's letting me know that my um, headlights are on. So now I won't leave my headlights on when I go into class and come out to a dead battery. So hopefully this helps you too. Uh, hope you enjoyed watching the video and passed around to your friends. Uh, and thank you much for watching.